y'all mad as a bitch about Kelly. Man, if the K-Hive or the Kelly's cuckoo's nest don't get the fuck up out my comments. Mad as a bitch. It's gonna be some problems for y'all too. Man, I talk about everybody. I don't give a fuck. Kelly's not off limits because she a sweetheart. Y'all crying more than all the bitches on the Real Housewives of Atlanta reunion. Why she do Kelly like that? I don't know. Are you serious? Hey, yeah. Calm down, yeah. Talking about Kelly ain't do nothing to you. She ain't never did nothing to nobody. Hey, yeah. You don't know her, yeah? You don't know what the fuck she did. Just because she made dirty laundry don't mean y'all know this bitch. He could have fucked Jay-Z behind Beyonce's back for all y'all know. He could have spit in somebody's food. She could be a whole Republican. She could have stole your girl. Shit, she already tried to steal Beyonce father. Y'all keep talking about you won't talk about Beyonce, though. Let Beyonce do some corny shit. Let her walk outside looking like that. Matter of fact, I came for Beyonce before. Then y'all keep coming for me talking about bitch your hair like a mess too. You don't think I know that? I know that. Gotta get it done over. It's just comedy. Alright now, y'all might want to chill the fuck out. I know y'all hurt, but watch your mouth. Old bleachy skin looking bitch talking about Bitch you're corny, you're clearly running out of jokes Bitch you're two-toned You clearly ran out of your own foundation Bitch if you don't get your 50 shades of brown face ass out my comments Bitch go back to Mac Looking like you recycle your lashes You forgot Instagram zoom in now? I thought that was eyeliner, that's hair glue Caked up on your lash line Clean that shit off with your swollen chin having ass you Look like hell boy in the face Never bitch gonna say she clearly is trying to get her fame by talking about Kelly because Kelly is more relevant. Hey, I, you mean to tell me out of all the celebrities in the world I could talk about to get famous, I'm gonna talk about Kelly? Boo, I'm already becoming famous. Boo, I do what I want. Man, Kelly is beautiful. But the outfit was an epic fail. Fuck you talk about. I don't give a fuck what the event was about. Don't ever do that again. Dead ass. Okay, so I was having an argument with my boyfriend. Okay. Okay, we kind of disagreed about something. He was at a party, and this girl just kept following him around, dancing wherever he was, following him the whole time. At this point, bitch, you're a mosquito. So she finally asked him, you want to buy me a drink? Eh, uh, bitches ass niggas that? I would never. So he told me that he said, nah, baby, I'm good. So she said, oh, you must got a girlfriend. He told me that she just stood there like she was waiting for a confirmation. But instead of giving her the confirmation she was looking for, this nigga said he chuckled. <laughs> and walked away. <laughs> Hell, where was the confirmation? So at this point, you're denying me. And I'm undeniable. And if you're denying me, then you're cheating. So basically, you cheated on me in the club. So he disagrees abruptly. Fuck you mean I cheated? That's not cheating. Be more pacific, yo. That's impossible for me, because I can't be an ocean. Now to be specific, you should have said, yes, I have a girlfriend. Her name is Just Hilarious. She happens to be a comedian. And you should know of her. But I can tell you don't, because if you did, you wouldn't be here. That's confirmation, dummy. Um, so I feel like if you fucking with a nigga and you know he's in the streets because you met him in the streets and something happens to him, don't be the loudest one at the funeral crying in the middle of the floor talking about how did this happen? How could that? I can't believe it. Cause I'm gonna tap you on your shoulder. What you can't believe? They killed him like this is impossible. Uh, no it's not. You want me to tell you how it happened? I mean cause I could definitely tell you that. And I wasn't even there. I mean it's just not hard to believe that he got killed if he was in the streets. So come on, get out. It'll be okay. You have kids. Go over there and sit with the rest of his girlfriends and fight over who's pregnant. Because at this point, his death is not a mystery. Then they kill me with the, all he did was sell his little drugs, stay to himself, he ain't bother nobody. Ah, uh, okay. Good afternoon, it's Jess with a mess. Oldie but goodie groups are looking to rekindle the flame in their careers. Escape is getting back in the studio for one more album. Also, Drew Hill. Even what's left of boys to men. Shit, let's just dig up Marvin Gaye. <laughs> sorry, sorry. In other news, judge erases Aaron Hernandez's murder conviction. Ah, ah, ah. His dad, let him rest in peace. State's attorney requested that they use a Ouija board to contact Hernandez to confirm conviction. That's fucked up. Anything to win the case. <laughs> Shade Room posted a meme that started controversy for women. I quote, name a few reasons women cheat because we're better at it. <laughs> I've been cheating for years. <laughs> Sorry. No, I haven't. Some strange white woman threw away all of her makeup and shaved her head bald. Not to support cancer but to start a natural beauty movement in hopes that women all over the world would join her. Boo, you're weird. No one else is gonna do that. Good morning, it's Jess with a mess, and my news is real. Delusionist artist Bow Wow. <laughs> Delusional. <laughs> What's wrong with him? <laughs> Sorry. Last night, Bow Wow Snapchatted a picture of a stack of money. Caption, I've always been rich. Don't come for me. 
insiders screenshotted and zoomed in on the picture. They found small print that read, property of Fugazi Printing Company. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> in other news, in other news, in other news, <clears throat> in other news, Odell Beckham posted a picture of himself getting ass shots. Oh, a tattoo. Oh, <laughs> tell me something. <laughs> the tattoo reads in bold, fancy letters. Enter here. Ah. Oh, no, baby. What is she doing, baby? That's not the one. As a matter of fact, that is the one. <laughs> Imagine him being arrested. Drop the oil and come out of the closet, sir. This is Jess with the Mess, and we're back. Psychiatric retiree Bow Wow is livid. He posted a receipt from a big-time dealership showing that he purchased a 2017 hearse in the full amount in cash. He said the reason for this is so he can take all of his haters to their funeral. Insiders just tipped us off letting us know. But apparently, the zoomed-in picture of the hearse that Bow Wow posted got into the hands of some computer geeks. They re-rendered the picture and zoomed out. And the actual vehicle was identified as a PT crew. Cruiser. They do look like little hearses. <laughs> I can buy a hearse with cash. <laughs> Full amount. <laughs> They're like 12 bucks. No, really. <laughs> Bow Wow was also said to be dating Phaedra Parks. Fraud recognizes fraud. <laughs> Back to Odell Beckham. While he's still in the closet, the LGBT community is right on the other side of that door. They're waiting for you. <laughs> Boo, we already know you're gay. Joan in my life. You know what I'm saying? It's time about talk about the playing. <laughs> I didn't know that was news. That ain't news. What is there to talk about? There ain't nothing to talk about. I ain't gotta explain nothing to them niggas. Bow wow, nigga. I've been doing this for years. So I got a private jet. I'm on my way to my, my private jet right now. Shit. <laughs> Y'all want some news? I give y'all some news. I'm in my private Bentley. <laughs> oh, That's wow. Me. I wish. This Corolla makes you feel like that? That's fucking awesome. What? Well, we're at your destination. You are getting dropped off at the community airlines, right? Um, I do have another trip. So you give me five stars, I'll give you yours. Thanks for riding with Uber. Okay, see, y'all know what I hate. I hate when people see me in person and they just be having this strange, confused look on their face. Like, you do look pretty in person. Ah! Like, I'm not up. Hold up. Uh, okay. So it's only one motherfucker in this house responsible for that. Chris! 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 I need you to wake up. <laughs> so I'm doing a video and as I glance at the sink, I find this. Are we broke? Why does our soap look like the bottom of a bag of lace? <laughs> you don't know? Not even people in the projects live like this. You know why? Because their rent is so fucking cheap that they have a lot of money left over for soap. Mm -hmm. See, you could probably wash up with this for another week. <laughs> but I cannot, I cannot. So since this is how you feel about us, <laughs> watch me, look at me. <laughs> I'm leaving, I'm leaving you. Cause I can be broke all by myself. <laughs> oh, what's up y'all, I'm at Taco Bell. I'm in a drive-thru and after I'm finished ordering my Doritos Locals Tacos or whatever, the lady says, thank you ma'am, that brings your total to 826. Would you like to donate a dollar to help kids go to college? I said, sure, if you can show me a picture of them. Who are these kids? They do that shit all the time. Would you like to donate a dollar to the Cancer Society? Uh, nah. Can I see the patients, please? I wanna see where my dollar is going. Then I get up to the window and she asks me again. So you're absolutely positively sure that you don't want to donate a dollar to help kids go to college? Ah! I said no. Bitch, I didn't even go to college. And besides, nobody ever gave me a dollar for college. How about you give them a dollar? Well, if they want to go to college, tell her ass to DM Nicki Minaj. That's her thing. Good morning, it's Jess with a mess. Kylie Jenner was spotted at a nightclub in Houston, Texas with her boyfriend, Travis Scott. Judging from the footage, Kylie seemed very uncomfortable and lost. Looks like the white bitch is in the sunken place. <laughs> Sink through the floor. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Imaginary Life Award nominees are Soulja Boy and Bow Wow. Looks like these two will fight for that award until the death of their careers, which is not much longer. <laughs> so sorry. Scott Disick has reportedly returned to drinking alcohol. His friends say he needs rehab. Ah, ah, niggas drink every day, B. 
Boo, I'm drunk right now. Harvard University will have a separate black graduation. Martin Luther King didn't die for this. <laughs> Boo, we segregate ourselves, but to each his own. And other news. Oh, it's sad. It's really fucked up. And then as soon as somebody says, we're going to have a separate white graduation, no blacks allowed, mm -hmm. then everybody's racist. <laughs> Where the world. Next. Yo, I'm in Atlanta. And bow out behind me. He don't know it's me. Oh shit. Hello? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Yo. Yo. Yo, Bob, hey. what's up? What's up, man? Yo. It's me. Who Jess. was you? you know Jess. I, I just hit a million a day. A million what? Come on, a million man. followers. What? Come Nigga, on, you man. know me. What's up? Bow. You got time jet waiting, man. I said, yeah. low bow. Did I smash? You might have. Did you smash? <laughs> hey, man, get the jet, man. Nigga, what jets? You don't have a jet. Stop. That didn't help me. You don't, you don't make these slow and afford to get up. I'm out of here. Yeah. Okay, close my door. No, don't get out and close the door. This. All right. Okay. Don't get out and close the door. I want you. Why are your knees so black? Because my family's black. <laughs> because I took a pair and I saw some joints. You did what? I saw, I, I, I looked at them and I said,